Ruby Bridges, written by Kara Freed. Table of Contents. Who was Ruby Bridges? Page 4. What was the South like? Page 5. How was Ruby brave? Page 7. How did Ruby make a difference? Page 13. The picture says where Ruby Bridges grew up. Ruby grew up in New Orleans, Louisiana. Who was Ruby Bridges? Ruby Bridges was a little girl who made a big difference. Ruby was born in 1954. She and her family lived in the South. The photo says Ruby Bridges photographed at age six in New Orleans, Louisiana. What was the South like? When Ruby was young, some laws in the South were not fair to black people. These laws kept black people and white people separate. The picture says, black people could not use the same drinking fountains as white people in the South. A United States law said that all children had to go to the same schools. State laws in the South still kept black and white children separate. Black children and white children had to go to different schools. Many people worked to make Southern schools follow the United States law. The pictures say black children and white children went to different schools in the South. How was Ruby brave? Ruby was chosen to go to a white school for first grade in 1960. She was the only black student in that school. Many white parents did not want their children to go to school with a black child. They kept their children at home. Some angry white people stood outside Ruby's new school. They yelled at Ruby every day when she went to school. The picture says people stood outside of the school and yelled at Ruby. Ruby kept going to school. Officers kept her safe. The picture on the top says Ruby was led into school by officers. Did you know other black students in the South went to all white schools like Ruby? In 1957, nine black teenagers went to a white high school in Little Rock, Arkansas. The President of the United States sent soldiers to protect the students so they could go to school. Many people helped Ruby while she went to school. Ruby had a nice teacher named Mrs. Henry. Ruby was the only child in Mrs. Henry's classroom. All the other kids had been pulled out of the class by their parents. A man named Mr. Coles helped Ruby too. Mr. Coles helped Ruby with the way she felt about going to school. Ruby drew pictures about her feelings. Many neighbors helped Ruby and her family, too. How did Ruby make a difference? Ruby was a brave girl who didn't let anything stop her from going to school. She showed people that children can help change a country. Did you know? This photo shows Ruby Bridges with President Barack Obama in 2011. They are standing in front of a painting called the problem we all live with. It shows Ruby being taken to school by officers. The next year, other black students went to school with Ruby. Today, many different children go to school together. Ruby still works to bring children together. She still works to make the world fair for everyone. The picture says, Ruby read a book about her life to students in New York City in 2000. Glossary. Brave. It's an adjective meaning having courage when facing something scary, hard, or painful. Difference. It's a noun meaning an important change. Fair. It's an adjective meaning just, right, or proper. Laws. It's a noun, meaning rules made by a government. Separate, it's an adjective, meaning set or kept apart. South, it's a noun. 
the southeastern part of the United States.